Hello friends, welcome to for tutorials. Guys, today I create texture change animation with using alpha. Firstly, guys, I go to more graph and select more text. Go to object and type. I type only S letter and alignment take middle. And guys, change font. I use Arial black font here and increase depth. Take 50 centimeter. Guys, go to display and select God shading lines. And go to caps here and start caps, take fill it. And radius, take 4 centimeter. Guys, go to fillet type, take engraved. See, guys, this is my text. Now, I create material. I show you texture, guys. See, guys, this is my blue texture and red texture. See, right? Guys, I give you both texture download link in description and you can download my project file. Go to Cinema 4D, go to create and new material. Open this material and go to color. Apply texture, apply red texture and open and no. Go to bump, check and apply same red texture. And no. Guys, increase bump strength. I take 30% and close. Apply on this text. Guys, select this material and see this is tag and projection take cubic. And see this is length U. I take 50% and length V same 50%. And seamless check. Guys, create blue material. Again, go to create and new material. Open this material. Color. Apply blue texture and open and no. Go to bump, check. Apply blue texture and no. Guys, increase strength. Take 30% and close apply again go to tag projection take cubic and length u take percent 50 and length v take 50 percent and seamless check now guys open this blue material open and go to alpha check Texture, click this small icon and take gradient. See guys. And check gradient. Type 2DV. And see guys, this is gradient. Click this small icon, little small black icon. And take none. See. Right? It's so easy, guys. Guys, create animation. Increase frame like 200 frames. And go to zero frame. Right click on gradient and animation and add key. Go to 200 frames. And select this curvature and go to full white and again right click on gradient animation and add key and play see guys right you can change pattern like uh, go to turbulence and turbulence take 50% again play see Actually, turbulence I take 
Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Now guys, I create background, create seamless background actually. Close. Firstly, take flow and background. Select this flow and little bit down. And guys, create background material. Go to create and new material. Open this material. Color, firstly reflection, uncheck. And go to color and see this is texture. Take gradient. Check this gradient and type take 2d v guys open this checker box open and see guys this is h color take 0 s color take 0 and v take 90 percent open this checker box open same h 0 s 0 and v take 70 and ok close guys apply this gray material on flow and background select both material and projection take frontal and select this flow and right click cinema 4d tag and compositing see this is self shadowing uncheck and compositing background check now guys lastly create light go to top view this is my light and up guys light intensity take 90% and copy this light control C and control V and go to inside view See guys, this is my first light and second light. Use in front and second light use inside. And guys, again play. Yeah, that's nice. Go to render setting, effect, ambient occlusion and global illumination. Go to NT, select best and guys output, click here, video film and take HDTV1080 and take 29 frames. Yeah, that's nice. And frame range, take all frame and anti, yeah, that's okay guys. Go to save, you can take AVI movie. And second option is JPEG sequence. I use AVI movie and click here. Create folder as animation. Take name texture and save and close and guys render. See guys, this is my render. Go to filter and lastly enable filter. Saturation take 20% and contrast 10%. After render, save this image. Click here. So guys, if you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.